Hey yo park fans and generic YouTube bingers, how's it going? I'm Voxesto and today we are back on the official PvP servers. So basically, um I logged in, a can a, a wild carno had killed my Tyranodon, which is like, oh what a shame, stuff like that. Oh, I didn't want to drop that. Oh there it is, cool. So I've just been tamed another couple of Tyranodons. Nice and quick. Not as quick as I would have liked, because obviously it's middle of the week and stuff like that. I'm going to keep that uh, stuff on me. Look, I've done a, done a cement and paste run as well, so I'm just getting some metal done. And I thought I'd take us for a little trip into the Redwoods, see if we can't find, like, a base or something, like something knocking about, something we can salvage, really, because at the end of the day, a base in the middle of the Redwoods, yeah, some someone would probably raid it, but the person who'd raid it obviously might smash the beds and stuff, and they might not want everything. However, the person who the base belonged to, they ain't got a bed there. And they might not end up actually getting back to the base to actually get the stuff and things like that. And they might not even care and they might have just like got well salty and left and stuff, we hope. But, uh... Look at that guy. But yeah, basically, I'm just going to go have a look around some bases and stuff. Well, just see if I can find anything, really. Just have a look around the Redwoods, that's all I'm doing, guys. So if you like the episode, hit that thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. And where shall we put this point? Stam. <laughs> right. Gotta look out for them Philos. We've got to look out for them Philos. 100%. Don't want to get ripped off my tame again. Because that was like ridiculous last time, wasn't it? But it was funny. It was funny. <laughs> Hopefully, I'll find some players or something as well. Be nice, wouldn't it? I can't get my stuff out on here though. It's annoying. It's annoying. It's a thing. So I'm gonna have to stop every two seconds because I've got a rubbish to run on. It's a better level. This one was level 50. I think at the weekend, if I can get on, and the server isn't full all weekend with my play time. Um, I'm going to get on and tame a couple of higher level Tyranodons and stuff like that because they are really good tames. Look, there's a Philo. That's probably the sneaky old sod who got me last time. It's going to keep nice and high. And then they won't be able to get me, will they? Ha! <laughs> Should also have, have, like, keep an eye out for a base location for us because obviously we'll probably want to push further into the Redwoods at some point. Because if big. Oh look, there's a base, look. Look what to tell you. Base knocking about. It once had turrets. It only now has smithy. Let's see what's inside the magic... Are you being serious? God. Let's try that again. Earthworms. Let's have a look. Got some boxes. Anything on there? No. Anything in there? No. In there? Ah, it looks like we ain't gonna salvage anything from this base. On to the next. On to the next. Look at this one up here, look. Everyone's been raided. It don't even matter. What? That one's got a vault in it. And a pin code. Whoa. Oh, look. It's obviously empty because there ain't no stuff, is there? Um, empty. Aw. Oh. Empty. Oh, we're not having much luck today, are we? Charcoal? Not even charcoal. They're thorough, aren't they? They've done a thorough job. Strange layout of a base. But there is a vault. I'm only 16 C4 away from opening it. <laughs> it's probably been emptied anyway. See, this is where you normally get bases. On this bit over here. Look, there's definitely going to be something there. No, it's not something massive though. It's only a little shack. Let's have a look, shall we? Quick run round. 
just a bed. What is that? Oh, it's my Pteranodon's wing. I was like, oh, what a freaky looking bit. Right, okay. So that was no good. Try over here. Oh, yellow drop with a ring round it. That is recipe for disaster right there, guys. People will want to get that. Someone on the server must see that coming down and be like, oh, yeah, I'm having it. But what we'll do is... Find a nice little spot. Make sure there aren't any phylos. Ugh. One of those stupid pigeons. We'll, uh, we'll just have a land. We'll just sit in this bush. Yeah, we'll sit in this bush and wait for it to come down. Look at that. Oh, this is going to be everything we've ever wanted in life. <laughs> you just know it, don't you? Don't you just know it? Ain't you rooting for it? You've got to be rooting for it. Look at that. It's got to be a Mastercraft fishing rod blueprint. That would be amazing. I don't actually know what it could be, what would really benefit from at this sort of stage. <laughs> but it's got to have something in it. It's got to be better than nothing. Have a look, you sneakies. What was that? Something down here with me. Pego. Just gonna land up here. Let that Pego get out of the way. Oh, there's like two of them. I don't want them to nick my stuff because everything I have is all I've got. And that is quite valuable to me. Even though it's like junk stuff. <coughs> it's gonna be alright, we're gonna get it. Oh, it's absolutely useless. Get off me. Is that a pre crafted journeyman mantis mantis uh mantis saddle? Yeah. Oh, what a waste of time. <laughs> it's just my luck. Obviously need it though, so it's cool. Right, so I've pretty much combed the majority of the redwoods now, and I'm quite surprised at how little I've actually found, so I think it's definitely going to be alright to build here, and like stay off the radar a little bit before I make a proper foothold on the server. So yeah, I've pretty much got free choice of where I want to build as well, there's not really any drastic bases anywhere, or any <coughs> immediate threat, or anything like that. So. Yeah, it's not going to be too shabby. I don't think it's going to be too shabby. Oh, look, rubbish again. It's always rubbish. No, I'm just going to check over this side. Because I just haven't done this corner yet, to be honest. It's like the one bit I haven't done. Now, you usually get a lot of bases along where this waterfall comes down. Because there's a few good flat spots there. But... Yeah, so far so good. I mean, it's not good for the loot. I mean, we've popped in, I think I've gone in a total of four bases now. And all of them have been completely cleaned out. Which is a bit annoying, you know. Leave some scraps for the little guys. Come on. Yep, what have we here? We've got a little base. He's smelting metal. See if we can see him. He's going out on his horse. He's seen me. Should we just talk to him? Oi, oi! How's it going? <laughs> I've just been looking around the redwoods to see if there was uh, anywhere worth building. Mate, there's like hardly no one built up in the redwoods. It's like empty up there, mate. He's not a talker, is he? <laughs> Alright, okay, never no mind, mate. Never mind. 
Ben's got a little base there, I remember that's there. I'll be raiding that soon. <laughs> well, there's another little stone base down there. What's that all about? Tribe of human. Yeah, we'll have a look at that as well. Any sneaky waterfall bases? They're easily doable. Well, that guy seemed like, I don't know, he was just knocking about on horse, weren't he? He's got set up, he's now smelting loads of metal, so we'll definitely pop back in there. Have a look inside his base. But I need some explosives and stuff. I'm not, I'm not picking another wooden wall down to nothing. This oh, takes too long, it takes way too long. Let's see if we can find something else. Oh, there's a blue drop there. Come on. Have a pick or a hatchet in it. The amount of times I've got picks and hatchets, blueprints, out of these blue ones, it's been unreal. What have we got? Just junk. Just junk. I'll get a good drop eventually. It's been a while, hasn't it? Right. Well, I'm back at base. I'll put my stupid blueprints away. I'll chuck that man to saddle. Because I was uh, I'm never going to use it anyway, so there's no point in carrying it. It's extra weight, isn't it? Um, I can start putting some metal together. I've not really got a lot. Is there anything I need before that? Um... What's long neck? A little while off long neck. Got to get on the old gunpowder binge as well. I'll get that started soon. I think it's literally... Yeah, gunpowder and oil, blah. Yeah, I think I should just start on the... Uh, on the structures. What saddle? Oh, horse saddle. Does that need metal? No. Alright. Get foundation done first. I think what I'm going to do is I'm probably just going to bang up like a 4x4, four four, pop it somewhere in the redwoods, probably too high, maybe three high. It depends on the location really. If I find a nice location, what I'm really happy with, I'll make it as high as I want. Look at them, I can actually craft them. Not very expensive for 81 armour. That's pretty cool, isn't it? Got a binge of that. I don't know why I've still got that either. It's ridiculous, isn't it? Or the woolly rhino for that matter. <laughs> But uh, yeah, I'm going to knuckle down, get this sort of stuff done. I don't like to bore you and keep you keep you going with that sort of stuff. And then hopefully next episode we'll have we'll have the new base up and uh, get stuff ready to go raiding. Really, a little bit of PvP in there. I don't really want to do too much yet because I don't want too many enemies on here yet because I haven't even got established. But I've got some CP now. I just got to get the metals. So I hope you enjoyed the short episode, guys. Sorry if it's like been a bit of a bore again, and I didn't kill that. So yeah, sorry I didn't kill that guy who was at his wooden base. There was no, there's no point, not yet, because I mean my pteranodon could literally carry thirty metal, if that. So the only thing I was going to get out of his base was some some metal, and I wouldn't have been able to carry it, and then I would have been doing like twenty trips. Would have been just silly. But anyway, if you did enjoy it, hit that thumbs up button, guys. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. And we'll see you next time. We'll actually get stuff done. Take it easy.